I guess you have an idea why pilots use checklists in the cockpit, but did you know how we use them? Checklists are used to make sure critical cockpit items and procedures have been completed before we pilots start a new phase of flight. Examples of this are the before engine start checklist, before takeoff checklist, descent checklist and so on. The normal checklists are typically read by the pilot monitoring and then responded to by the pilot flying. And after a checklist item like window heat has been read, the pilot flying must first look at the switch position, verifying it, and only after that answer the response. The pilot monitoring must then listen to the response and after verify that the answer is correct according to both the actual switch position and what it should be according to the checklist. This way the read, look, listen format is correctly followed and any pilot must speak up if a response or switch position is not correct at any time. Now join me and Ben from Airline Pilot Performance as we give you loads of insights like this in our free virtual type rating course. Open to everyone, there's a link in the comments but you need to hurry up because it closes very soon.